Hi everyone, this is Tech Ken here with my robot friend, Pineapple. Hi everyone, I'm Pineapple! And today, we're gonna talk about how to... Use a code.org checklist. Let's use the checklist to play. Why do we even need a checklist? We have to use the checklist the whole time to make sure we're doing it right with our partners. It helps us think about our work and do it right. To do the game right, I gotta use the checklist every time? Those are the rules for playing every level of the game. Fine. If you skip the checklist, you gotta do it all over again because you didn't do it right. So I would do the checklist. OMG! Just remember, if the steps on your checklist are different than the ones that Pineapple and I did, just do the steps in order. Just do what it says. Just follow the checklist. Let's look at the checklist. All the checklists have a kid and a robot on them. I'll be the kid and you be the robot. I can do that. I'm gonna touch the number one on the checklist with my finger. It's the first thing we need to do. It shows the robot builds a bug <laughs> while the kid closes their eyes. Wait, so they want the robot to trick the kid? Yeah. Great! Now we did step one on the checklist. Let's touch step two and see what that says. It says, press run. Let's watch what the algorithm you built for me does. Okay, press run! Now, let's touch step three and do talk about the game. Whoa. Game talk, which is this one, is when you talk about the game that you're playing on the computer. All of these red and yellow questions on your checklist are talking about what's on your computer screen. Here is the wrong way to do it. If you just read the words without looking at the computer, it makes no sense. Let's read it. Kid says, what did we want the algorithm to do? To debug this, we need to... I agree, disagree, because... Did that make any sense? That made no sense! You just wasted my life! Here's the right way to do it. If you see a line with a picture of the game in it, That means that's when you give your answer from what's on the computer screen. Your answer should come from the game you're playing. That's what these pictures of the game mean. Let's do it the right way, where the pictures of the game means you get your answer from the computer screen. What do we want the algorithm to do?
to debug this, we need to take out the N and we need a S there. Is there anything left on the checklist? Yeah, there's a picture of a track band. Because no one should touch the track band until you see the picture of the track band. Here's when the kid tells the robot what to fix. What should I do? Okay, can you um, throw out the N? Yeah, I could do that. And then put... Uh, S? Put it in S. And then press run. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah! Well, thanks so much, Pineapple, for showing the kids how to use their checklist. We did step one build the bug, step two, press run, and step three, talk about the game. And last, we use the trackpad to fix it. Anytime, JK! Bye, kids.